Hey you guys, oh my gosh, I missed YouTube. Like, I've been wanting to make a video for the longest time. I keep telling my husband I want to make a video, but then I don't. I want to make a video, but then I don't. I wasn't making videos because my son is just wild and he's one and he just doesn't sleep and it was just irritating me, but I'm good now, he's asleep now. So. But anyway, I want to talk to you guys about severe dandruff. I had really bad dandruff, like very bad like it was all up here it was just everywhere and it was like big flakes like i'd have to wash my hair like every two days and then i started washing my hair with like the cantu cleansing the sh um sulfate free and it was like bubbly and it would like it would leave my hair dry and like squeaky and your hair is not supposed to do that so and then i was just using like the neutrogena Anything that said medicated, dermatologist, like, recommended, but nothing was working. So I switched to the Build Up Buster. They had, like, just came out with it, like, a couple months ago or maybe, like, a year ago or something. I don't know how long ago it was. But I switched to the Build Up Buster, and I didn't like it. I didn't like it at all. So I switched back to the Cantu, and then I switched back to the Build Up Buster. And then I just, like, well, I'm just going to keep using it. So I kept using it and using it and then like I was getting better results as I was using it. So my hair coming from being had sulfate to sulfate free, the dandruff was like coming down like it was getting less and less and less and less. So in order for you to get rid of your dandruff, you need to switch to a sulfate free. Like the sulfate, I don't know what it is about the sulfates, but it's just like it's something about the scalp that just it doesn't like the sulfates but you switching to the sulfate free really helps and using this brush like you like all right you put you wet your hair you put the build up buster on it and you just scrub and you just scrub and you scrub and then you wash it out and then after i had used the build up buster i used the the no poo decadence and then i scrub and scrub again and then after i do that i condition oops with the one condition so i'm able to this is two weeks i had to wash my hair every other day it was so bad it was so embarrassing it was so embarrassing because i'd wear black and then i have like flakes everywhere i had to wash my hair i never wore my hair in a wash and go because my hair it just wouldn't curl like these are my curls that's nuts like i still can't believe my curl but that's another video but anyway if you want to get rid of your dandruff switch to sulfate free products it doesn't have to be diva curl but I'm obsessed with Diva Curl. Like, Diva Curl saved my hair. And I had, like, my hair was, like, thin. Like, it was, like, thinning out from the combing, from washing it so much, from dyeing it. Like, I've been a, a blonde forever. Like, since high school, I want to say, like, the ninth grade is when I first dyed my hair. And I'm 29 years old. So that's a long time to be blonde. But anyway, if you want to get rid of your dandruff, switch to a sulfate product, okay? Sulfate free is your way to go. And Diva Curl is amazing. It saved my hair. So thanks for you guys watching my video. God, I'm so happy to be back. Like, I'm so happy. But I'll be making another video soon. I'm going to make a video of the um, the leave-in, the new leave-in, the Diva Curl. Once it gets here, it's supposed to be here on Monday. So I'll probably make a video on Tuesday. So you guys have a blessed day. Bye.